Hey people of the interweb, I'm Nostalgic Dave, and welcome back to Six Days of Sacrifice. Ooh, what to do, what to do? Open the locker, maybe? I walk really slow. It won't open. Almost like something's holding it shut from the inside. Or it's locked? The time lock must still be active. Well, by all means, go through the door. Are you... I'm not going to hurt you. Is your mother around? Or your father? My god, your eyes. What happened to your eyes? Okay, there are the dreams again. Oh, I forgot about those. Oh, good, you're up. Hi. We could discuss the plan. Plan? The door has now been unlocked. Our next move will be to take Canning hostage. Again? If at first you don't succeed, this door is being guarded by the Trilby Guard. It will be your task to distract him. Why me? The threat of the physical violence must be made to get Canning under control. You obviously cannot make this threat, so it has to be me. All you have to do is lure the guard away from the main corridor, giving me a chance to slip in. You will know when the coast is clear. Do you have... Oh, there. Take my number. We can't reach the outside world, but we should be able to make cells... Make calls with Okay. Words I can't say. Call when you have achieved your objective. If there's any problems. Okay. I'll give you Ch Genesis number. I'm sure you'll still have many questions. Click the phone in the top menu. Down! Okay, so I'm going to guess this is unlocked now. Yep. Hi, right, okay. Let's just keep it going. He's not even following me. Did I do something wrong? Okay, there's much more space on this side, so probably... Hi. Okay. Hey. Hey. Who should I call? Samantha Hearty. Yes, Mr. Corbin. Go ahead. Ah, uh, I got the guard away from the door. You sure? Excellent. Meet me outside the office door. What are you playing at, Takabe? He's still there. We must find a way to remove him on a more permanent basis. Got you. Get in. I don't like this. We'll see about your friend soon enough. Just leave it unlocked. I've literally... I foresee some difficulty in doing that. I have literally no idea how to open it. Um. Fuck! Okay! Um. God, it's some kind of ancient skeleton. Oh. Oh, so that's... The... I thought John Defoe was in space by now. Uh... 
Uh, Trilby, Trilby, Trilby. Can we just talk this mano y mano? I'm very confused. I am very confused. That wasn't the right room. It's been so long since I played this list. Let's look around in here, see what we can get. The disturbance. Play with the disturbance. I don't think I could touch it. I don't think it would. Talk to the disturbance. Not in a talkative mood. Some kind of manifestation hovering above the ground. It looks so strange to my eyes. Like a black hole in the air uh, uh, itself. Couldn't bring myself to touch it. Okay. I don't think so. It's like the room was just stripped of everything. Okay. So what now? I don't know what to do. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm so confused. What do I do? Fuck you. What the hell? I, I don't know, man. Take something out of the trash can. Nothing in but ashes. Nothing in but ashes. It's for medical supplies I have absolutely no idea how to use. Search the desk? It probably belongs to the chief medical officer. I mean, we know the password. The guy was stupid enough to give it away. It's too technical for me to operate. Oh, please. Okay, I officially have no idea what to do. I officially have no blasting idea what to do. You're not, you did not see me. Well. Okay, there has to be something. Touch screen. Touch it. Touch the touch screen. The screen seems to be locked out. I can't access any functions. Oh, poop. Look at the monitor. I think it's a security monitor, but it's showing nothing but snow. Snow? Won't open. Must be a security lock. 
Uh, what to do, what to do, what to do, what to do. What room was I in before? That's my bigger question. It won't open. Does a security lock requiring high clearance? It's a touchscreen control panel probably for the monitoring system. I'm so freaking confused. I don't think so. I don't think so. There's nothing on the screen right now. I'm having particular trouble seeing. Okay. What? Turn to open. Bodge balls. I feel like it'll have something to do with the lens. I know what I'm supposed to be doing. But the the freaking disturbance. Lens. I may need it. Lens. I don't think so. I don't know, man. I don't know. Such the dusk with the lens. I don't think so. Oh, come on! I am literally going to try the lens on everything. I feel like it'll have something to do with the lens, but... Uh, trilby. Trilby, 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 Trilby. We don't want... We, we, no one likes you, Trilby! This... That way. Because I have so many other places I can go. Dun, 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 dun. Don't see me. Do not see me. Somehow you got away with that. I'll add it to my journal. Canning. Ensure that the prisoners remain sealed in the holding cell for at least six days. After this, it will no longer matter. Do not fail, Canning. This is your chance to redeem yourself from the crime of allowing the Orzachowski woman to explore the complex unsupervised. What prisoner? Oh, 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 hi, hi, hi. Got you. Oh, come on. Get in. Not risking it this time. We'll see about your friends soon enough. You ain't scaring me this time. She's gonna glare at ya. You're really hurting my- there it is, okay. What the hell? Well, that did and didn't work. Hold on. Can I actually... Can I phone her? Who should I call? Dr. Hati? Yes, Mr. Takabe. Mr. Takabe, go ahead. Supposed to be getting the chili card away from Canning's office door, and preferably out of the main corridor altogether. I did not mean to push that again. Quite my main question is, how?
I'm so confused. My brain is just... Book. What book is this? I'll add it to my journal. Twice did the 28th day of the seventh month pass, and the prince gazed with great concern upon the land of technology, as the carving of the slave mass passed through the hands of a great many ignorant men of technology, but the king would not let him take his vengeance. For he said, the guide seeks the carving of the slave, and it is through the desire he shall fulfill his destiny. It will not be long before the guide learns that his duty has not yet been completed, and then he shall do as I have foreseen. And as the king said it, so was it. So, so was it so. For the bridge keeper did touch one of the ignorant men, and by their conjoined hands was the thief wife thrown down. And truly did she know the name of the king. And with this act, the guide... Wait, thief wife. Are you referring to... Um... Oh, what is her name? The girl, the, the blonde girl from the first game. I can't remember her name at the time. Um... Call me stupid. But I think that's who you're referring to, isn't it? Isn't it? With the act, this guide said, I see you know, bridge keeper. I have found you, and I have not forgotten. And he came to the tree that was the prince's soul, for it was here that the carving of the slave had been brought. Um... Okay... Yeah, I don't know what to do with it. I don't know. I don't know what to do. I'm completely lost. <sighs> I found a couple of things. Hi, Janine. What is this? I it to my journal. Book of Prayers, 2-7. The body is the physical form. It is the sum of what time has made it to be, and so it is of the past. The mind is sharp and logical, it is concerns itself with the here and the now, and so it is of the present. The soul is love and hope, it is the dreams of what is to come, and so it is of the future. Body, mind, and soul, past, present, and future. We give thanks for them all in the name of the king. What? <laughs> what did I just do? Let's just move right, move left, move right again, forward, move left again, and then talk to her? Why? Um. How about no? That's all I want to. Okay. I feel like I'm going to need to talk to you, actually. So we'll do that, and then we'll end the episode there. Janine? Yes? What do you think we should do now? I'm not sure. Maybe it's just some. If you haven't taken care of hostage, I'm sorry. I, I can't. I don't think I can face him. I can't even bear being in the same room. Why? I don't know. It's like the fear comes out of nowhere. Like a punch in the stomach. That's weird. So you were the one who sent the tip? Yeah. A week ago, I found this place. I sent the tip straight to the police. And then later, they caught me and threw me in the cell. I was expecting them to send a SWAT team or something. Your life doesn't work like that. They can't send in the guns just because of an anonymous person sending 
It says there's an unregistered basement extension. Sending a building inspector was pretty much all I that could have been done legally. I guess you can blame me for getting you in this mess, huh? I'm really sorry. You weren't the one who pushed me down an elevator shaft. Tell me about Trudy. The character? Well, he was the main character in a bunch of horror movie serials, which were based on a series of novels from the early 21st century. But someone sent me some rare old newspapers, and they suggest Trudy was a real person. Really? He was a cat burglar, the original master thief. Finally arrested around the mid-1990s, the story goes that he joined some secret government agency, and they encouraged the novelist to fictionalize Trudy so that people would eventually forget he was ever real. And I'll tell you something else. There was a photograph in the newspaper. That guy up there, Canning's guard, looks exactly like the real Trudy. You think he could be the same guy? Of course not. He'd be over 200 years old by now. But the resemblance is really creepy. A horrible nightmare. But to get used to it, there's something about this place. Something in the air, maybe. Mm, I guess. But I haven't slept well since day one. There was this kid. A welding mask. Welding mask? I've had dreams about these too. How can we both be dreaming about welding masks? Just psychic power? Be serious. My granny always used to say I was a little bit sensitive. Sure. Okay. Have you seen Sam? I just left a room that Sam was in, but have you seen her? Logical question. What do you think we should do? Not sure, maybe ask Sam. Who are you so afraid of, Janine? Him. The, the one who's out there. I don't want to talk about it. That's descriptive. What do you make of Dr. Hottie? I probably don't know much more than you do. And yes, I've asked her many times what kind of work she was doing for the cult. And no, she wouldn't tell me either. If you want to find out more, you'll have to get it from the horse's mouth. Do you think it's alright to trust her? She's still sick of it. Working for them, then she's gonna be convinced. Have you seen Sam? She's sleeping in the quarters. Yeah, okay, yeah, that's it, we're done. Okay, well, while we're staring at each other, I'm going to leave this video here. So thank you guys so much for watching this episode. If you liked it, push that like button in so far you can't see it anymore. If you really liked it, consider subscribing to the channel. Got any suggestions for me for any other um, horror games I can do? Just let me know in the comments below if you want to check out any of the games in this series that I've done in the past. Click the box down over there, or if you want to check out the rest of the playlist for this particular one, click the box across from my head here. In the meantime, I'm out and I'll see you guys later. Bye!